Hey friends, welcome back to the channel Creatively Sandra. On this channel we do all things pin related, Disney related, unboxings, everything Disney fun. So today I have a Pin Me Up Wednesday haul for you. It is a pin haul and Pin Me Up Wednesday is a day that we share our pins here on YouTube. So Pin Me Up Wednesday was created by four of my friends. Um, we have Shay from Disfly Life. We have Diara from Diara's Lounge. We have Stephanie from Ethereal Creed and Devony from Disney and Devony. And they created this day, this collaboration for us to share our collections, kind of stay accountable, have a day that we're really opening the packages that we ordered. Um, if some of them have longer videos than others, then that shows the accountability part is not working. Just kidding, just kidding. We have fun, we buy our pins and we're not gonna stop. But anybody car can participate, so you will see lots of other participants in Pin Me Up Wednesday. We just put a hashtag of Pin Me Up Wednesday in the title or in your um, video description, and that way you can find everybody who is participating. So I have some pin mail to share with you. First, I wanna mention the, um, I was gonna say elephant in the room, but the shelves in the room. So this is the first time you're seeing my shelf background here with lounge flies and gym shores and a few other things. Um, we've got a little bit of everything that I love up there. I finally got the lighting um, attached to the top. Now, I don't know if you can tell, but there are a couple of glass shelves on top which help the lighting go down to about halfway. And then there's a shelf that doesn't move, so you can't add, although I could put more below, but um, I thought it looked nice. I, I'm enjoying it. I enjoy having it on in my room. This is my office I also work from. So three sides are Disney and one side is work. Um, let's get into the pins. I've rambled on enough. Okay, so first of all, I've got some pin mail from the Happiest Pins on Earth. They are the Disney Chris family. So Disney Chris and her husband, her dad, her mom, they all participate in this. They do live sales. They do board sales. Um, their live sales are typically Tuesday and Wednesday. They are also pin makers. So I do have a code. Ooh, I have to not cover my little speaker microphone now, but I do have a code to help you get free shipping on an order. And I'll, I'll link that down below because they do fantabulous fantasy pins and you need to check them out for that. But they also do um, on their live sales, sell other people's fantasy pins as well. So lots to check out. One night is fantasy pins, one night is authentic Disney pins, and they do some um, super sales every now and then. So some really great deals on there. So the first pen I got um, is from the PTV series. Then this one is, I think her name is Swizzle Malarkey. And these are the, oh, I need to get better lighting. Wait one moment. Okay, hopefully this will help you see the pins a little better. This is Swizzle Malarkey. She is um, from Wreck-It Ralph, and she is one of the sugar racers. She is adorable with her ice cream there. It is kind of a, actually, let me put some glasses on. So it looks like, kind of like a hot fudge sundae. Um, so sundae in a bowl, and then some hot fudge and whipped cream on top. It is super cute. I do have a couple of others. I have Francis Flugger Butter. I have um, Jubilina Bing Bing. And I have one other, she's minty something that I can never remember her exact name. But I'm excited to add another one of these to my collection. So that was one purchase. And a couple of his sales, I did only purchase one item. But one really cool thing happened with those purchases is I got I earned um, entry into a club. <laughs> it is called the Pow Pow Rewards Club, which is pretty cool. What this means is you get discounts. So when you attend, I think five shows, you become an Imagineer. Attend and purchase from five different shows. Now it could be um, the Tuesday show, the Wednesday show, etc. When you purchase from those live sales, you start to get entries first level is Imagineer, and then it goes up from there. So with Imagineer, it means you have officially purchased from oh four separate events this year, and you are earning a Pow Pow pin. 
and I think there are discounts associated with it. So um, when you do eight shows, you can claim one pin from the posted glimpse for the rest of the year. Uh, you can reach hero level at 14 shows and you get the glimpse plus you get a free Disney Chris fantasy pin and you'll be entered into a golden Mickey drawing and it just goes up and up from there. So that is very cool. So there's the pow pow pin pow pow 24. And then the pin that I ordered. So I'm excited to have achieved that, <laughs> you know, it took a lot to achieve it buying stuff, right? But I, you can see, you can get it. You don't have to spend a ton. I've just bought one pin the last two times I attended. It, of course, is, you know, better use of your money to buy multiples because you're paying shipping. But this one was cute. So this is during the fantasy pin sale. This is a Designs by Jen pin, and it is Doug, and he is adorable. So I previously bought the same series of pin they had Carl, and I showed that a while ago on my channel, and now it is Doug that I am adding to the collection. So that is adorable. So we've got Doug and we've got Swizzle Malarkey and let's go to the next one. So the next package I op pre-opened a little bit ago and couldn't figure out where the heck this came from. It's something I needed, but I couldn't figure out who I had traded it with, where I had bought it. I was looking at live sales. Turns out it was from the pin and pop trade event. And I had mentioned when I showed that last time that one of my pins went into somebody else's box and that person kindly sent it off to me. And it is from Pinderella Shop, which she has a channel on um, Facebook that I know she does sales and, and pickups and things like that. Okay, so this one was from the Butterfly series. So I did trade for this. I just didn't trade with her necessarily but it got packaged and she notified Jen that there was an extra pin in her package, which was very kind. And she also forwarded it on to me. And this is the pin. It is from the butterfly set. This is the, oof, is this Mulan? I can't remember. Or is this purple and green? Who is that one? It's not the, Tiana, even though you might think that. I don't think it is. Let's go back to the package. Or maybe it is the Tiana, because the other one is, is, yeah, I think this is Tiana. Let me show you the package. So these were the choices, and that's Rapunzel there. I believe that is the Mulan. This is Moana. Wait, who's that one? That's Mulan. Oh, I'm so confused. Is the green one brave? I don't know. <laughs> I'll have to go look those up. So I think this one is Tiana and that's awesome. So that's from Pin and Pop, but it is now with me where it was in the wrong hands before. Okay. I have a trade from my friend Debbie, Debbie over at the Disney Nana. And it looks like there's a little more in here than I expected. So cute envelope with adorable sticker there. I gotta get some more of this size envelope. All right, I recognize this paper. I think I have the same one. This is adorable. <laughs> it's a little note and it says, here's Hades. I wasn't sure if you completed the train, so I sent that pin to Desi, Debbie the Disney Nana. Debbie, thank you. Let's see what we got here. Oh. Okay, so here's the zap she sent. I don't think I have this one. And I've got those right behind me somewhere. Somewhere. I do not have this one. Okay, Debbie, we are good. Thank you. That is definitely one. I think this is Cruella's car. So this was a villain's little car train set. And um, I only have a couple and figured I'd just work those in trades, but I hadn't paid attention to it in a while. So I haven't added to it. So that is awesome. Thank you, Debbie. And then the pin I knowingly traded with her for is from this evil or villain set. It was a Disney Parks mystery set and it is the Hades pin. Let me take it off of there so you can see it without the backer card. These are really cool. Um, I have, 
at least one other. You guys see me looking around the room all the time because there are pin boards everywhere in this room. So this is Hades from this set. This is what the mystery box set looked like from the parks. And I thought these had like sold out originally and then I started seeing them in the parks, but I don't, I haven't bought any boxes yet, but I've got, I think this is my third one just from trading. So that's always fun. So Hades is added to the collection. Okay, next I have, let's see what I've got. I've got another trade. This is from Disney Crazy Family. And I had <laughs> opened a package. When I opened it, I knew the pin that came in it was for Marie from Disney Crazy Family that she would love it. There is a bunch of little stuff in here. Cool. Thank you, Marie. And Duchess, I'm sure you participated. Okay, so we've got some adorable stickers, some little pirates and mermaids, and I love that he's in a little float. I've got a castle, always welcome here. Here's a note. Sandra, thanks so much for the wonderful trade. Hope you enjoy the surprise for one of your niche collections or as a nice trader. Happy pinning, Duchess and Marie, Disney crazy family. Let's see what's in there. Thank you for including an extra. So the pin that I sent over was, um, I had a short you may have seen where I opened the Pixie Plush package and I pulled Morph. And I knew that <laughs> Marie wanted Morph. So I sent that over. Oh, look at this. I got a little tiny Rapunzel figure. That is cute. Thank you, that's so fun. Oh, oh, this for a niche collection. This could go on my board of pink pens. Oh, this is cute. So I think this is from Fantasia. This is the hippo. So that is the little extra she sent. I really didn't put my light in the right place today. So I have to turn these. That's always the challenge when I switch from one side of the room to the other. Um, it's like resetting up every time. So bear with me on that one. But that is super cute. I love that hippo. She's like a ballerina hippo. Very cool. Okay, and then the pin we traded for. So um, I traded her morph. Knew she had to have it and looked at her pins and I wanted this one. And silly me, if you've been watching my channel, you'll see that I just got this one in pin and pop. And I totally forgot about it and got excited when I saw hers. So I asked for this as a trade. This is Rapunzel as a mini fig pin. So these came out and I think one of the places they were available was Claire's. You know, the place in the malls that sells mostly kids stuff, uh, jewelry, earrings, hair ties, bags, but they also have fig pins occasionally. So they have Stitch. They had these when they came out. I don't think they're available anymore. There was a few princesses and then um, there are other characters and other fandoms in them as well. But they're super cute little fig pins. So I'm going to leave that in the box. I think I left the other one in the box. So this one's probably going to be the one I open and add to my collection and the other one will become a trader. So thank you for that Marie and Duchess. And then the last trade bag I have here is from Connie. And actually, I'm not sure if this one is a trade or this one is a pickup. So Connie does pickups. Connie Loves Disney is the name of her channel. She has an amazing YouTube channel that you want to watch. So do um, Disney Crazy Family. Sorry, I forgot to mention that. And Disney Nona. And I'm going to leave all of their information down below, the links to their channels. These are ladies that I'm friends with, but also just enjoy watching their channels. Um, so back to Connie, Connie loves Disney. She does pickups as well in the Disneyland parks in California. So that's super fun to um, have access to. And she does free pickups. So she, you, she just charges you retail plus the shipping. Something is a little stuck in here. So let's see. She's included. Oh, she knows I love all things Pixar. So she's included a Pixar Fest guide map for me that is fun i love getting these especially for the parks you don't get to visit um and if i do get to visit anytime soon again i can study this before i go and know where i'm going 
she included that. She's always got some goodies in here. So I do feel some other things. And what we did is I had a pin that I got that was a really um, rare pin that came out and sold out immediately. I had an extra and I ended up trading her for my pickups for that month. Um, okay, so she's included this little, I just dropped one, but it was a cute little donut charm. <laughs> <laughs> and then this little shaker crown, which is adorable. So there's always cute, fun little stuff in her packages. A classic Mickey, which I love. And, ooh, I don't know who this one is. She's dark haired. Is she like a Snow White version? Oh, Belle, maybe. In a different style dress? That's a pretty one. Okay. And then the pickup that Connie did for me. Oh, let me show you her card. So I will include, like I said, her information below. But here's her card. Connie loves Disney. So her her main thing she's known for on her channel now is doing um, Tasty Tuesday, where she shows you things she tries in the park and some rides and some pins and some merch. And so it's so much fun to watch and see what's going on there. There's a little thank you card in here. She says, thank you so much for the trade. So that is correct that we traded for these bins. And it is just continuing the monthly collection for me. So this is the um, Disney Parades, Fantasy Parade pins. So this is the Disneyland collection. And this is Jungle Cruise. That's what that one's representing. It is limited edition. These are available only in the parks and this set is available only in Disneyland. They are a limited edition of 2,500. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, but it does have the little Mickey head stone there. That's a little blurry. The new camera is coming guys soon, soon. So we have that. So that continues the collection. This I believe is the June pin. And then the My Home pin that I've also been collecting this month is Ariel. So that is beautiful. This is like a window collection. Each pin, each month, they've had different metals. So there has been gold, there has been the rose gold, there has been like a, a silver, and they all have the princess's initial. I only learned that maybe last month, I think from Diera, <laughs> pointing it out on her channel from Diera's Lounge. And then, oh, this is a little crooked. So you've got, oh, it turns a bit, I think, but let's take it off the backer card. I think I just realized these, I don't think they're supposed to open, but it does move a little. I just kind of did that to the pin. <laughs> I'm not sure I was supposed to do that. It's kind of hinged on there. It's interesting because the hinges, it's not a hinge, but they're, um, it's put together with these rivets here, but they don't show up on the front. Anyway, let's put that on a small board so you can see better, but she is beautiful. I love the beach background there and um, maybe something to do with uh, King Triton's home there, her home as well, but it is a beautiful pin. Thank you so much, Connie, for the pickup. I do really appreciate that, um, the pickup and the trade. So that just worked out great for us this month, but um, we will continue to do the pickups with her next month. Okay, I thought this was gonna be a quick one, but we just went on and on. But here are my pins for today that I traded or purchased. I will include everybody's information down below so you can check out all the channels, plus our fig pin from Disney Crazy Family. And just want to say thank you to everyone who traded. Thank you to the live sellers and thank you guys for being here. Go ahead and leave me a comment down below. Let me know what your, your favorite pin today and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye.